Hey, it's Witch Queen here. So, Mortal Kombat 11 has leaked. Now, this is only rumors and speculation, so take it with a grain of salt. However, it seems like the official reveal of this game is in just a few days' time at the Game Awards. So the first clue that this game was being made was a voice actor, Malo Garza, excuse the bad pronunciation and any future bad mispronunciations. So he is known to Latin American fans being the voice actor of Krillin in Dragon Ball Z and the director of Dragon Ball Z and the super dubs, but however, he voices Reptile and Liu Kang, and he tweeted just a few days ago that he won't be coming back and reprising those characters. So, someone, a QA tester, leaked a bunch of information and I'll try my best to remember everything. So the first is this will be announced at the Game Awards. The development cycle was four years, which is the longest any Mortal Kombat game ever. And it's had one year of, you know, concept ideas, developing concept, and three years in development. The concept phase of this game started way back in the development of Mortal Kombat 10. So it was years ago and it's crazy. So there is a story mode and an adventure mode. So, adventure mode is two player co op, online or offline. It's drop in, drop out. And it's included in like the base game. Everyone can play it. So, there's a new version of like Shaolin Monks type gameplay where you can customize your character, like weapons and stuff, and you can customize a lot of things. And it seems like there will be microtransactions or loot boxes, so daily boxes and things you can buy. So the story, so spoilers I guess, it seems to be following three playable characters. So the first is punishing Raiden. So Raiden will be punishing anyone who dares to harm the Earth Realm and um, Liu Kang Emperor, Liu Kang and Empress. Katana are building up an army and they're trying to find like stone relics I believe from the gods and de uh, deities from the Mortal Kombat universe. I'm not too sure. The leaker did not really go into depth. And third is Shang Tsung, excuse bad pronunciation, and Riku are, you know, they made a deal with Total Khan to be like the protectors and the police of the outer world security. However, Riku ha is, you know, has um, a gender and he gets killed in the middle of it. So they are using a new engine which is Unreal Engine 4. The previous games have been Unreal Engine 3. They're 
better animations. It seems like it's way better than the previous game. There's like a cancel, fake kind of cancel animation where you can kind of cancel mid animation your move. Not too sure. Um, there's a lot of things I'm forgting. There's Fujin is playable character and there's a lot of non-playable characters. So there's Goro. Um, I've totally gone blank. There's Goro, Johnny Cage, and uh, I've totally blanked. I'm so sorry. I'll you know, leave them in the description or a writer comment below. Totally gone blank. But there's a ton of characters who were previously playable but are not playable anymore. I can't remember. I'm blanking. I'm so sorry. But yeah, what do you think? Are you you know, excited for the official reveal of Mortal Kombat 11? Have you played any of the previous Mortal Kombat games? Are you into the lore of the universe? Do you know what's going on story-wise? Who is your favorite character? Let me know what you think. Leave your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, favorite, comment below. Or tweet me at Witch Queen. Hit the bell button below for notifications on new videos and subscribe. Thanks for watching.